All right, well, it is International Recipe Week on Live in the D. We are sharing our experiences as we try out recipes from dishes around the world. So I saw a recipe on, I think it was either Reddit or Pinterest, doesn't matter, and it's a Serbian burger or a Balkan burger, and I knew I had to try that out. So here it is. Uh, that's that's live. That's right here in front of me. Haters going to hate, potatoes going to potate. Looks right. good, actually. So, yeah. Uh, and then we have full screen pictures that we're going to show you of the process of the, the meat uh, and how it comes together. Okay, so that's the finished product. Uh -huh. I made it. Um, there is the meat cooking. That is a blend of pork, lamb, and ground beef. Ooh, all the good stuff. Okay. Uh, there is the pita bread. Now, the pita bread that I found at Nino Salvaggio, um, for the, you know, the pocket effect, this is much larger than the Balkan burger that I saw online. And we did mention earlier in the show that that was the second round of pita that you bought. Right, because of the dog. Because Violet. <laughs> uh, All right. Of course, they just took a bite. This is a red pepper paste and then um, something uh, that I've never heard of before. It's like almost quite butter, but not quite butter. So, like, what, like a mayonnaise buttery type? I don't know how to describe it. I actually still haven't tried it yet. It's, it's on this, you know, finished product in front of me. I just haven't tried it yet. So. My question is, what did you do? So you mentioned the three types of meat, but did you season it, like, besides salt and pepper? Anything no, else? No, I did not, so because just... the recipe didn't call for it. Okay. Now, it actually has a name that I, I wouldn't even attempt to pronounce. It's Plesjevica or, or Plesjevica or something okay. like that. It's like one of those, the first four letters are all consonants. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, so I, I just tried it, the meat. Uh, it's an interesting taste. The blend of the three different meats is something that um, I haven't had before. And you dressed it up with onions, tomatoes, anything else? Yeah, onion, pickle, and tomato. Ooh, pickle. So I'm gonna try this. This is a mixture of that almost butter, but not quite, and then the red pepper paste, okay? My bad. What, um, not where bad. did you get the almost butter but not? Uh, Nino's. Nino's. Mm -hmm. Got it. Okay, that's a, that's a unique taste. Do you know how, like, venison has a unique taste? Mm -hmm. Okay. Unique. Um, different than, you know, like the lamb meat you'd get in a gyro, mm -hmm. right? Not quite a cheeseburger taste. Um, the pork in there is interesting because it gives it sort of almost like a breakfast sausage kind of thing. Oh, yeah. So, um, yeah. I am. Um, I don't think I would make that again. You don't think so? But what about if you tweaked it a little bit? I don't, you know, maybe if I had one proper. Yeah. There used to be a restaurant in Macomb that was like a, uh, that kind of ethnic restaurant. Okay. Um, I don't think it's, I hope it's open for their sake. I don't remember the name, but mm -hmm. um, I feel like <clears throat> if I had this uh, in Serbia, it would probably be much better than what this is. Well, I mean, it's your first time. Don't don't be too hard on yourself. I just love the fact that you're on, whether it's Pinterest or Reddit, and you're looking up new recipes and trying them out. All right. What would be something you would try? Uh, something sweet. Oh, okay. There you like, go. Uh, Michelle did, like, one day, like, different types of waffles for mm -hmm. her, uh, one of her segments, and... That was cool. I, I love waffles. That. Yeah. Uh, if you want to try it out, we will be sharing the recipe I used on our website. Click on Detroit.com following the show. But based on this uh, taste test here, I think you could probably pass. <laughs> <laughs> or, or perfect it. May, let, us, let Jason know uh, what he needs to do to make it a little bit better. It's just a different taste. I mean, a you know. different taste. Awesome. All right. Tomorrow. Tomorrow's menu is taking our taste buds to Armenia when our Kyla people shares a dish that grabbed her attention at a wedding celebration. Always a great place to learn about new foods. Uh, so that is tomorrow on Live with the D. Mmm. Well, pickles and onions are great. Mm.